Hi guys, this is a redirect to my reaction to episodes uh, 82, 83, 84 and 85 of Hunt Hunter. This is a quadruple reaction but I split into two videos. So the first video will have episodes 82 and 83 and the second video will have episodes 84 and 85. Oh my god, like <laughs> jeez man, this arc does not hold back in the amount of violence and overkills and just intenseness altogether but i will say that these episodes were really good though like damn kai is an absolute badass and i refuse i fucking refuse to believe that he got beheaded by nefapito i refuse i mean i know that nefapito is on a whole other level in terms of Nen and abilities because she has this demonic aura, an extremely demonic aura, but I still believe Kite actually at least fled. And Gon seems to believe that he is alive, even though Nefapito was holding Kite's head at the very end of the last episode that I watched. No. I just know that has to be a decoy. That has to be a fake head, you know, like to get away with escaping. I don't know because the thing is, Kite can use like multiple weapons, so there might have been like I don't know, Shadow Clone weapon or something, you know, to get away and fool the enemy. Then again, she would have used her senses, surely. Um, but, you know, I refuse to believe it. There must have been... Because they didn't actually show Kite actually getting killed. They only showed him getting chopped, in his, his arm getting chopped. But he's he himself, they did not actually show his death. So that's why I'm believing that he's still alive. He's just in hiding. So it's up to Gon and Killua to find Kite, to rescue him, to save him. Because that's what Gon and Killua are wanting to do now so um yeah and um so firstly what happened was gone and Killua and kite they were up against uh, a couple of the chimera ants because they were they approached the chimera ants nest which is fucking huge like jeez man they have this whole entire nest area full of an army of chimera ants and they used some very cool techniques oh my god kai is an absolute badass so it would be an absolute shame if he was to die like come on man like we he only got introduced like at the start of the chimera ant arc and now you want to kill him off like really i i refuse to believe that because he he's just he's so useful you know like you can't get rid of a character like that so no way would he get beheaded like that. Fuck off. <laughs> anyway, um, so what was, where was I? Oh yeah, Gon was up against, uh, who was it? It was one of the, it was the turtle, the turtle, um, Chimera Ant. And Killer was up against, um, Centipede Dude. And they were using, they basically, like, Wait, was it said to be? No way. Forgot. Nah, Kilo. He was up against. Oh yeah, the rhino, the rhino guy. That was it. I I watched four episodes, guys. So there's gonna be like these little deals that I forget initially. But yeah, they they basically they won those fights, even though it was quite hard. But. It's gone, and the, in Kilwa they they are learning at a fast rate, so gone for the first time used his scissors technique instead of the rock technique, um, which basically sliced the turtle in half. Oh my god, that Grim Reaper dance that um, Kite used against all of those Chimera ants, like jeez, man, this guy is OP as hell. So. You know, like, he still could have a chance against Nefapito. It's just about, like, um, fleeing afterwards. I don't know, teleporting. He could have actually teleported or just, I don't know, unlocked a weapon that made 
Nefepito get fooled by this decoy or something. I just, I refuse to believe that she actually beheaded him. Just, no, man. If she did, I, I'm going to fucking roast the shit out of her in the next reactions. I will roast her. Anyway, um, so... What else happened? So, uh, Ramus got Nen, and that N when Nef Nefepito was born, got out of her um, nest, uh, basically, um, because she is one of the Queen's Royal Guards, the first uh, Royal Guard to be born. And she's a kitty, and she, basically, she wants to learn everything there is to learn about Nen, so she used Poku. She used the, the like, she's she like she stuck two sticks <coughs> inside of um inside of Poco's brain just to like extract all of his memories about Nan to get all the info about Nan and so she f knew about all the different character categories of Nan and found out that she's a specialist Nan user and Ramit is an enhancer user now my question is how the hell did never peter get such a dark demonic aura because everyone else has this like white gleam around them but she gets like this extra extra powerful demonic aura so how did who is that from exactly like what human what rare human did they encounter that had that kind of nen um I don't know, it was that just by chance that certain individuals just get this demonic aura or something, I don't know. Um, but she's an absolute threat. Like, Kite got scared. And this guy is calm. This guy is so damn calm. But when he sensed Nefepito, oh my god, he looks so scared. So he made, he literally he demanded gone and kill what run for their lives because they just wouldn't have a chance whatsoever and even he got himself caught yeah he, he got his arm got chopped off by nefepito so nefepito is no joke honestly like this girl jeez um she, she's not to be underestimated um so we never actually saw the fight between Kai and Nev Pito, so I'm not gonna like think that he's dead. I refuse to believe that even if his head was shown in the last second of the last episode. But you know, things can things are not always as they seem. Thankfully for Gon and Killua, um so Killua he basically ran for his life with Gon. He knocked Gon out and then ran for it and now there are reinforcements to go against the Chimera Antarch, the some mayor uh, wants all of the Chimera Ants to be exterminated, so they recruited Natero. So I'm glad that we're seeing Natero again, as well as two other people that I don't remember seeing before. There might be new people. Um, so yeah, we've got some pro hunters for reinforcements. But it's not enough, because she... The queen, she has this massive, massive, massive army, and now they know how to extract Nen now, so it's really, really bad. Really, really, really bad. Like, God, man, they are completely 100% outnumbered. So I don't know how the hell Gon and Killua are going to save Kite from these bitch asses and, <laughs> and save everyone. Save all the pro hunters from getting killed, eaten up by the chimera ants. Yeah, that's all I have to say. And what do you think of these episodes? Let me know and stay tuned for more.